here at the Toyota Mazda plant site. We're just down the road from Decatur, but the residential development for the 4000 workers and their families hasn't happened here in town until now. Up to 300 new homes will be able to be built in the Upper and Old River Roads area. The City Council just okayed the extension of a sewer line there to make it possible. We want people to know that Decatur is not just a great place to work, but it's a great place to live and raise a family. At the same time, the Decatur Morgan County Chamber of Commerce has made a task team to focus on residential development. It's something they couldn't wait until next year to do. A push for that now so that we could be prepared um, when Mazda Toyota opens as well as again our existing industry that are in an expansion mode as well. It's not quite the if we build it they will come mentality. She says residents have been asking her nearly every day for a year about more residential space. Economic leaders say it's high time. That's always been the age old question which comes first retail or residential. In our case the last 10 years it's actually been uh, retail. They expect the population to grow. First thing we want to go to 60,000 and then we want to go to 65,000. And for new families to grow with it. My children are grown and I want them to move back here one day. There's and a so, ways to um, go that's... before dirt is moved in the River Roads area, but they say the level of conversation about making Decatur home has already begun. Putting the Valley First, Renata DiGregorio, WZDX News.